A tragedy that rocked this proud city and its people. On the 22nd of August last year, nine-year-old Olivia Pratt-Corbell was fatally shot in her family home in Dovecot, Liverpool. You're under arrest for on suspicion of murder. Thirteen days later, Thomas Cashman was arrested and was later charged with the little girl's murder. Over the past few weeks, a jury at Manchester Crown Court has heard the details of this senseless tragedy. That night, CCTV shows shot after shot being fired at the gunman's target, Joseph Nee. Wounded, Nee tried to escape, and seeing an open door, he sought refuge there. This was the door to Cheryl Corbell's home. She'd opened it to see what was happening outside. Realising what was going on, she tried desperately to keep the two men out. Frightened, nine-year-old Olivia had come down the stairs. A shot was fired, injuring Cheryl and hitting the little girl in the chest. That shot would prove fatal to Olivia. In the following days, Merseyside police began their investigation to find the gunman, appealing to the local community for information. The killing of a nine-year-old child is an absolute tragedy and crosses every single boundary. And I would urge them to do the right thing so we can put this person behind bars. Meanwhile, as the hunt for the gunman continued, a heartbroken community gathered together to lay Olivia Pratt-Corbell to rest. Now, seven months on, Merseyside police continue to push their crackdown on crime. Beforehand, uh, crime reporting was relatively low. Uh, intelligence uh, coming forward was relatively low. But since the unfortunate, unfortunate events, our engagement with that with this community has massive, massively improved. It shows that the community won't change. It's hoped now that the murder of Olivia Pratt-Corbell will be a watershed moment for gun crime on Merseyside streets so that no other family will have to feel the pain that hers did. Sophie Reaper, GB News.